Want to shoot super smooth videos like the ones you see on the internet? You are at the right place. In this video, I'll break down the best gimbals for smartphones this year. I've put together a list of options that will meet the needs of different types of buyers, whether it's price, performance, or quality. Now, let's get started. Number six, a great option is the DJI OM5. If you're on a tighter budget, we recommend checking out DJI's last generation gimbal, the OM5. It offers many of the same features as the newer Osmo Mobile 6, but it can often be found heavily discounted, making it a bit of a bargain. You get the same excellent extension pole, a super portable design, and excellent ease of use. The accuracy of the subject tracking takes a slight hit compared to the newer models, but it's still much better than the majority of competing brands. At a price like this, you can't go wrong. It's a superb option for just about anyone. Number five, a portable powerhouse is the DJI Osmo Mobile 6. DJI's Osmo Mobile gimbals were, until recently, pretty much unrivaled as easy to use, portable, and feature-packed gimbals for the average consumer. And the best of the bunch is the Osmo Mobile 6. If the Insta360 flow didn't come along and one-up it for the same price, this would no doubt be at the top of our list. And it certainly served as a large source of inspiration for that product. However, while the Insta360 Flow bested it in a few areas, the Osmo Mobile 6 still has advantages of its own. Crucially, the joystick is analog, so you have more granular control over the gimbal's movements, but we also think the construction feels hardier too. Number 4. Best for multiple devices is the Ziyun Crane M2S. While it may not be quite as versatile as the marketing suggests, the Crane M2S can stabilize compact system cameras, as well as phones and GoPros, or other action cameras. Unfortunately, even with the upgraded Quick Release 4 system, swapping cameras still isn't seamless. But if you want to carry around one stabilizer to cover multiple devices, the Crane M2S is one of the best options. Compared to the older M2, the Crane M2S has a useful 1000 lumen fill light, supports faster charging in only 100 minutes from empty, and offers up to 10 hours of battery life. We found when using a Pixel 6 to test it, the MS2 required us to rebalance the phone when switching from landscape to portrait shooting, which was a pain. The ZY Play app isn't as slick as DJI's, and do make sure any mirrorless camera is compatible before you commit. Number three, best for built-in selfie light is the Xeon Smooth Q3. The Smooth Q3 is an unashamed DJI clone, even down to the design of the removable warning stickers. Yet it also has one feature that DJI's stabilizer lacked, until the OM5 was launched that is. It's the LED fill light that is handy for illuminating your face or your subject in unfavorable lighting conditions. It's warm, white, and you can't change that, but you can choose from three different brightness levels and it rotates, unlike DJI's, which only can face you. It's a decent gimbal overall, offering three axis stabilization, good battery life, and all at a sensible price. The only niggle is the ZY Cami app, which simply isn't as good as DJI's Mimo. But you can use your phone's stock camera app if you just want to use basic video modes. Though we haven't reviewed it, the 2-axis Smooth X has a built-in selfie stick, but costs less than the Ziyun Smooth Q3. Number 2. A professional pick is the Ziyun Smooth 5S. The Ziyun Smooth 5S is a bit of an outlier in this list, but it's still one of our favorite smartphone gimbals. It forgoes compactness completely, with a design that's more in line with a professional mirrorless camera gimbal than anything that's designed for mobile phones. What you get in return for the bulkiness is unmatched stability, superb ergonomics, and tactile physical controls. If you're more interested in creating feature film style tracking shots than filming yourself for a vlog, then this is the one to look at. It's not perfect. The app experience is unnecessarily complicated, subject tracking isn't too reliable, and it takes a little while to set up. But if you want the utmost smoothness and configurability, you'll definitely want to check out the Smooth 5S. Number 1. Best overall is the Insta360 Flow. The Insta360 Flow is a striking gimbal that looks a little different from any of the others. It's an exceptionally clever design that manages to be the most compact on the market, whilst somehow cramming in a tripod, extension rod, and great battery life. Despite how impressive the design is, it's the software that really won us over. Insta360 has used its 360 camera expertise to craft the best software experience of the bunch, with the most advanced AI tracking that we've tested to date. No matter what type of content you're creating, we think the Insta360 Flow is likely the best choice. It's the most portable, has the best software features, and comes at a reasonable price. All right, that's all for today's video, guys. Please drop a like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more videos like this.